Picture this. You're sitting watching telly at home. It's late at night. There's a knock on the door. Standing silently on the step are two young kids. A boy and a girl. They're about eight years old, just looking at you. Weird. Weirder still, their eyes are completely black. No, you're not listening to a Real Life Ghost Stories episode, but rather an extract from Sheer Luck vs. The Paranormal. Sheer Luck vs. The Paranormal is a three-volume series of books written by Dean Wilkinson and illustrated by Joseph Keane. Sheer Luck is the world's only kid-consulting paranormal detective and he is on the trail of the supernatural, including ghosts, ghouls, witches, you name it. He's helped out on his travels by his sister Watson and the atomic sprite Mycroft. We get requests all the time from people looking for books or movies to help introduce their kids to the world of the paranormal in an age-appropriate way. And Sheer Look vs. The Paranormal does this. The three volumes cover loads of stories like zombies, cursed paintings, even things like Slender Man and the Black Eyed Kids. This week we're doing a giveaway of three full sets of Sheer Luck vs. The Paranormal books that have been gifted to us from MX Publishing. If you want to enter into the giveaway, just read the post that goes along with this video and it'll give you all the details. It will also give you a comprehensive mini review of this series of books. And I'm going to leave you with one more story taken directly from volume three of Sheer Luck vs. The Paranormal. Have you heard about the coincidence of the 1898 novel The Wreck of the Titan, also known as Futility, written by Morgan Robertson? In the story, the seemingly unsinkable British passenger ship The Titan hits an iceberg and sinks in the North Atlantic. Many drown because there aren't enough lifeboats. The story occurs around midnight in the month of April. But 14 years later, in real life, in the month of April, At around midnight, the real Titanic sank. This seemingly unsinkable British passenger ship hit an iceberg in the North Atlantic and many died because of the lack of lifeboats. 